the year for women to demand equal pay and opportunities, says new president Carrie Kruger of Neutral Posture. A woman-owned business manufacturer and leader in ergonomics, designing work environment products such as cubicles, office chairs, and more. Kruger shared how overjoyed she was stepping into the new role after being with the company since 1989. We are already opening doors and breaking down those glass ceilings. She says typically manufacturers employ 30 percent of women. At neutral posture, about 50 percent of our workforce is female and 60 percent of our management team is, is female. So we are not only woman owned, but we are also woman run. And that is absolutely fantastic, especially in an industry that is so male dominated. In a 2021 study on ergonomic technicians, there were 61.1 percent male technicians compared to 33.3 percent of women technicians. And who says women can't drill? Well, that's just some of the many tasks Kruger says women do right here in this warehouse. March 15th marks Equal Pay Day, created by the National Committee on Pay Equity. According to Business.org, Texas ranks number 22 for smallest gender pay gap, women being paid 19 percent less than male counterparts. As CEO, Rebecca Bainick says equal pay is the goal and women should demand it. You need to ask for the raise. You need to ask for the promotion. Neutral Posture starts at $15 an hour and is always looking for new hires dedicated to growing the 30 plus year old business. We're a hidden gem and we make these incredible products right here in Bryan, Texas. We want to make sure that we can continue to do that and we want to make sure that we are known. Known for furniture that she says changes people's lives. When people are struggling because they're not seated in the chair that they need to be in or they do not have their computer set up and their desk set up the way they need to, it is harmful to their bodies. That's where neutral posture comes in. Starting the company in a garage, Bainick and her mother never thought they would take it this far, which is why they say, This is the year of women.